The year is 2163. Due to the acceleration of global warming, sea levels have risen drastically. Almost all landmass has been swallowed up by the sea, which then froze over at the beginning of the Great Ice Age. Most animals are extinct, except those who have adapted or thrive in cold climates. The human race has been pushed to the edge. We have been reduced by war, starvation, and disease. From a population peak of 7 billion, 500 million is all that's left of a once mighty species, now thinly spread across the Earth's frozen surface. While we may be reduced in numbers, we have been liberated. Freed from work, inequality, poverty and money by the great advances of 3D printing technology, the second renaissance. The survival of every human being is almost guaranteed. All our needs are taken care of by 3D printing. Food, fresh water, clothes, objects, and even houses can be printed. Humankind no longer has to work. We can print robots who can be programmed to do any task that we don't want to do. Humanity has been left to our own desires. We only do the things that we want to do. We only pursue our passions. All the plans for 3D printing can be found in a big database on the Internet, the backbone of the new world. The Internet is completely free and accessible to everyone. All of humanity's knowledge is stored here, and we still use Facebook. While humans have become self-sufficient on their own and no longer need society for survival, we still like to live around others with similar interests. We live in small living pods that can fly and that we can print out in pieces and assemble. Larger living pods can't fly but glide across the ice on large skis, harnessing the wind with massive sails. Pods allow a great deal of independence and mobility, but they can also be connected to other pods which can grow into a community or even whole cities.